And we got some points. Emily, let me in. Nuh-uh. Okay. So, I think that's because it's raining. I could be wrong. George has a quest, so... Yo, George, get me back to where George was. Where's George? I definitely want to do George's quest. Uh, I need to get in my car and then see exactly where I need to go for George. I desperately need to do George's quest if he's open. If not, then I need to just end it all. Is that George? That's George. We are on the right path. Come on, George. If I get to you, then it won't all be for nothing. I'm already lost. Car. You need to not be in my way, car. That's George's house. There's also a uh, card up there. All right, Georgie boy. Get out. Not the best place to park, but whatever. Come on. Come on, I think he was open. He's open. Come on, come on. Oh, it's worth it. It's all worth it, just for this moment. This side quest is the best side quest to do. George? Which do you prefer, mustard or hot sauce? You didn't come all the way to my house just to ask me that. I did. You don't have other things you should be doing? Of course I do. But I'm interested in you right now. Interested? Agent Morgan, look, my mother is sick. If it's not urgent, I'd rather we did this later. Is she very ill? Well, don't know why I paused like that. I have to say, it doesn't look good. I'm sorry to hear that. Anything I can do? No, this is a private matter. I can't ask for your help. You know, back in D.C., people always came to me for personal advice. I'm here to in case help you didn't know, letter. George, There's D.C. No need stands for, that, for Agent Morgan. Uh, Detective Please. Comics. You need to abide by the rules, right? Okay, I get it. I didn't mean to invade into your private matters. Oh. George, I just thought you could use a friend who wasn't a dumbbell. Haha, <laughs> sick burn. Back when I was a kid. My mother really liked this flower. flower. Oh! Yes. A flower, you say? A small flower. No name. It grows somewhere here in Greenvale. Although I must admit, I've never seen it actually growing anywhere. I think it would make my mother happy if you could get her that flower. George, that's good. Great idea. Every woman likes to receive flowers. You know all about that, right, Zach? In any case, I don't. this is a personal matter. Make sure it doesn't interfere with the investigation. I mean, it already has, not, but hey. But I'm going to find that flower for you. Dun -dun 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 -dun. George, I have the flower. Watch him be closed. Let me in. Let me in. I desperately want to make sure he doesn't close that fucking door on me. Agent Morgan. I'm not even going to play games. Here's a flower. Take the flower. George, here it is. The nameless flower. Agent Morgan. I love you now. Our social Tell link has been raised. I, I will now die for you. During my private hours. Tell your mother I hope she gets well soon. Yeah, I'll do that. This will make her feel at least a little better. I sure hope so. I really do. We got radio. You know what radio does? It lets us fast travel. Only to locations we've already been to. But boy, won't that be helpful. This. It's an emergency police radio. If you're ever in trouble, use it. And I'll be right there. Thank you, George. Okay, are you done talking? Now, Agent Morgan, don't take this the wrong way. It's not an emotional thank you gift for helping me with my mother. I'm giving you this so we can do our jobs more smoothly, that's all. If only you would have given me that without having me look for a flower, but we did it. We completed the side quest. So now let me see if I can peek on George. I want to see him do some squats. Guess we'll grab his card too. Of course it's George Woodman. So, like, if you don't do side quests in this game, at the very least, do this one. 
You have to do the uh, Arnold one. I can just try to get in from there. I cannot uh, spy on him. Doesn't look like he has anywhere to spy on. Uh, you need to do the Arnold one, but that's easy enough to get done when you're just at the police station. Uh, and then from there, get a flower when it rains. And then at some time at night, you have to go to George when it, uh... Where is radio, though? Is it in here? Radio. Use. Beep, beep, boop. So, see, these are all locations we've been to already. We can go to Emily's house. I'm only doing this just in case if uh, she's open now. I forgot about the car screeching. So, when we have to backtrack to other places like the milk barn, it's going to be nice and simple for us. Emily? God damn it, Emily. Why do you do this to me? All right, so that being said, I don't have the, uh, the, um, what is it called? The, I'm blanking on it. I don't have the graveyard open, but we can go to Anna's tree, I believe, to sleep it off and, uh, basically be able to do other missions. So I'm going to do that. And I'll be able to eat there, and everything will be great and merry, and I'll love life. And we won't have hell like that uh, other episode where I failed everything. So, I'll just hang out at the tree, and then we'll do side quests. So, we can finally finish this. At long last. Uh, the only downside about sleeping continuously and eating is that you uh, become a stinky agent pretty quickly but it's really not that big of a deal you just lose some money i would say it's worth it also a uh, hot tip for this too just don't uh bother eating until you get the right time the right kind of like day and everything all right i'm stinky but let me do the side quest for you. Hi there. I'm gonna I'm gonna move boxes. Hello, Agent York. Have you had a change of heart about helping? I was helping you before. Let's do it. Thank you. Hun. Don't talk the to me. Storage room is this I way. love the way the fruit looks behind her. That is just a texture. I don't need to look at it. This is fantastic. I can't stay mad at you, game. Okay, hopefully I remember how to do this properly. I had the pattern down before, but you know, the game decided to be mean to me. The main thing is don't push it all the way. That's a lot of scary flies flying around me. And I need to push you over here. Just think, if I was able to do that quest before, I would have been able to get the gold card. Spoilers, there's a gold card. Uh, so then I want to push you back already. The good thing is I should have plenty of time for this, so... They should hopefully not close on me! It was weird, too. Last time, didn't they, like, close at noon? It's kind of why I think I might have screwed up and it was on break or something and I uh, just panicked and thought that I failed but it still was upsetting and then the rain I mean the rain was a big problem let me just push this all the way and we should be fine I want to double check real quick uh no not all the way see I almost screwed up actually Oh, uh, could you imagine? And then they close again. Watch them close right now. <clears throat> Wasn't that simple? Good work, Agent York. Yeah, it I was good I work. Count on you. Oh, it wasn't that difficult. Give me the silver card school, and give me my money back for the people. rod. It turns out they were right. Here's your reward. And then. give me a delicious I'll cookie. That looks good. Well, it doesn't. What is card. that? It looks like a picture of Jello. We got silver card. 
Thanks. <laughs> There aren't that many people in this town that have one of those. It's a pretty rare item to have. So it's a real treasure. I'll York, sure did anyone tell you you were a stinky agent? <laughs> you should use it to buy a gift for that special someone. We'll give you a big discount. Unfortunately, I don't have anyone to give such a gift to. <laughs> really? Come on. Well, anyway, be sure to come by again. So sadly, because we uh, didn't do this quest on the last mission, we won't be able to do job three yet. Spoilers, there's a job three. It gives you the gold card. Who would have thought? You don't have a side quest, right? No, I think he gets one later. Gun case won't help me with my stinky agentness. Oh! There's a card here. It's mine now. I got... Grikach? I don't, I don't know how to pronounce that. Oh, extra bonus. Get out of my way, Keith! Please! Hey, bro! Uh, I guess bye, because you don't have a quest. Okay, hang on, bro. Oh, oh map! Spiritual map of Greenvale. That's special. We'll, I guess, want to do that right now. Yeah, we'll buy it. Hey, man. The spot on the map is called Cope's Tunnel. It's one of a couple of places in town where, like, spooky oh, stuff I knew happens. it. Ghosts. I'll tell you a story, okay, man? Yeah, tell like, it to uh, me. Don't go spreading it around. The spirits, they don't like publicity. <laughs> Spotlight. Back when this place was a lumber kingdom, you know, the rockin' 80s. Spooky. That tunnel was the main connection from the lumber yard to this town. Every day, huge trailers would like come in and out. Lots of traffic, dude. Of course, some people were like all up in arms. Save our nature, stop pollution, you know. Big business yeah, was pushing is. in here from all over the US of A. Everyone was bickering over the forest. So some of the town people got even more worked up, you know? They started a protest inside the tunnel itself. That sounds dumb. I guess maybe that was the start of all the bad times. Bad times. Oh yeah, man. Metal Rough gear. stuff and heavy times, man. The conservationists and the lumber workers faced off with each other. Neither side was backing down, and that made things worse. Amid all this chaos, there was a man and a woman who got engaged. Problem was that the man was a lumberjack, and the woman, she was a tree hugger. Oh my god. They rarely ever fought. But then, one morning. They had a lover's quarrel. I'll never do that. People think that her love of nature clashed with his profession. Really? How could that be? know what they really were fighting about that morning. He cuts down the trees and shouted. she hugs him. He Who would have thought? He called her an idiot. And then he stormed out and went to work. If only he had known, that would be the last word he would ever say to her. When he finished his work for the day, he got in his car and drove home. When he got to the tunnel, He saw lantern lights glowing faintly. Those fools, not again. He just thought they were protesting in the tunnel again. And to scare them a little, he decided to speed up. Oh no! He probably thought they'd all scatter so he wouldn't hit them. But the lights didn't move. In fact, one came toward him. A second later, there was a thud, and the lantern flew up into the air. Slammed on his brakes too late, of course. Then, totally freaked, climbed out to see what had happened. I don't need to tell you who he hit, do I? What's who? more, in her mangled hand, there was a letter to the head of the lumber mill. A peaceful settlement offer. The woman had no other relatives other than the man. And the lumber mill took no responsibility for the accident. I, they It was going out of business anyways. What happened to the man then? No one saw him again. Some say he killed himself, or simply just vanished. You know, he might still be in the tunnel, weeping over his lost love. So now, some folks say there's a ghost of a young man that haunts the tunnel. I told you it was called Cope's Tunnel, right? Well, check this out. Some people call it Corpse Tunnel. Oh, spooky. Be careful, Mr. FBI. See, I told you this was a you Halloween game. You go down there by yourself. <laughs> I'm proper spooked. So these are um not too bad to do. I'm not gonna view the list. Hey, he's happy again. So we we yeah okay the, the map's gone. 
I'm done. Thanks a lot, bro. Ho ho. Coco gum. All right, I need you to like get out of my way. There we go. I can leave now. Finally. Get me out of here. Uh, we'll we'll do like all these quests. Uh, but those maps. If you notice, that one was map A. There's a handful of other ones. Will give us infinite versions of the guns we get. So that one will be for the submachine gun that we currently have. I'm pretty sure anyways. Now there is a bit of a better thing we could do for that. But we won't be able to do any. Um, I mean do besides the infinite submachine gun. But we won't actually be able to do anything about that currently. I think. Oh, I think this is the Cope's Tunnel right now. I think I would have to drive there. Sub sub target area is what that says, even though it's hard to read it. So let me double check. I know there's another set of side quests I would like to do. We could always go and eat from Thomas, but let's not. It's so much easier just to do this until you get where you need to be. Especially because it shows you the side quest thing, even if it's not available. Thanks, Emily. I think I... Did I go past it? Oh, Usha's got something for me. I guess we can go see Usha. Because I think I went past what I was looking for. I want it to... Who's at a... Oh, me! Francis York Morgan! I was... I thought it was weird that there was three people there. Why... Why am I not, like, seeing the house I'm looking for? There it is, that's the house I'm looking for. Honest house. But, it's not there, so I guess we'll fast travel to the hospital. A wrong one. I need my items. I wish this was in, like, their key items. It'd be more convenient than having to scroll all the way down. We gotta go talk to Usha. We gotta see what Usha's gotta say. Yeah, we need that bullhead catfish. It looks like a good catfish. I don't actually remember what Usher's quest is, but I knew he had a side quest. Like I said, we kind of want to get all these done while we can. Just I should probably save too. We want to get these all done while we can because we have a limited time and I know the game gets kind of funky when you do chapter select. I think, like, arguably, you could have a gold card already if you chapter select. You'd probably get a lot of side quests done by chapter selecting, but... Really want to make sure it doesn't... Affect me. Where... Oh, oh, wait, I'm in the map zone. I can actually just... Quick select. Right, this is the only time you can do this. That's not Usha. Where... Usha? That's a key room. Usha? Is he like down a level? He might be down a level. I don't even know how to get down a level. God damn it. Is there. Can I see stairs? There we go, over there. I need to go like. I need to go this way. This way. To check the weather, but I ain't doing that. I ain't about checking no weather. Watch him not even be here anymore. Oh no, what if he's not here anymore? I won't be able to see because... Mm. It's fine, we're good. Where you at, Usha? I got my posse of flies with me. I may be a stinky agent, but I'm gonna help you with whatever problems you have. Usha? Does my map show me now? Usha! Our boy Usha's here. I, I feel like stopping to look at these signs, but I know it's dangerous, so I'm not going to. Oh, that's a phone. I got confused for a minute. Yo! What you got? You, you are not sitting on that chair. Mm -hmm. You are not on that chair, Usha. Usha. Something on your mind. Oh, Agent. You are inside the desk. Just the person I wanted to see. I take it this isn't a chess problem. 
Is it something a little more serious? Oh yeah, it's serious. I just can't figure it out. Now you've snagged my interest. Tell me more then. Mm, it's a question... Well... It's God, I don't want to hear anything about Fiona's, Fiona's riddles. Her quizzes right, are... You might want to write this down. Abysmal. It's a little long. A.G. Silver. N.A. Sodium. G.E. Germanium. E.R. Erbium. L.I. Lithium. K.R. Krypton. Uh, mm. I.R. Iridium. S.B. Antimony. Uh, uh, excuse me? Selenium. E.U. Europium. And SR strontium. The elements love you, Doctor. What are these? Elements from the periodic table? Oh, that's right. I just I thought it was some chemistry write this down. problem, but that doesn't seem to be it at all. Please, if, if you can figure it out, you let me know, okay? Okay, Usha. I'll give it a shot. You let me know as soon as you figure it out. No, I'm gonna keep it to myself, Usha. Uh, can I look at the clues again? Please actually tell me something in the view list. Uh, no. You're not telling me. Thanks. Usher! Mm, it's a question... Well, it's yeah, more like no, a riddle I gotcha. that Fiona gave me. Now, you might want to write this down. It's a little long. A.G. Silver. N-A sodium, G-E germanium, E-R erbium. It's the first L letters. Lithium, Angel. K-R krypton, I-R iridium, S-B Angel antimony, kiss. S-E selenium, Kisses. E europium, and S-R strontium. The elements love you, Doctor. Angel kisses. Well, that's simple. It's an anagram. Read the first letters vertically. Line them up and read it horizontally. Uh, vertically. I okay, could just now, run through all that. the first letters vertically down. Angel kisses? I could I just give all of those uh, answers course. until something Angel works. Angel kisses is freckles. The answer's Fiona. In other words... Fiona is in love with you. Nani. Oh. I, uh, I see. What is she, it's like 12? cute love letter. Is it? Those it's who not have that the courage cute. to love have the courage to face rejection. And she what if he just afraid. never solved it? Don't you think that's wonderful? Uh, you know, just between you and me, she's been sending me signals like this for over a year. Then why don't you respond? Is there something else you're interested in? No, no, it's Chess. nothing else. It, I mean, don't get me wrong, I don't dislike Fiona, I just... I don't know what to do. Usha, don't tell me you've... Yeah, that's right, I've never had a girlfriend before. Oh my god, I can't believe Usha Please, hasn't had a don't girlfriend. Don't tell a soul, promise. I won't do your autopsy if you tell. Usha, that's a fresh new way of saying something horrible. Anyway, thank you for figuring this one out for me. Now I'll I, I can't rest. believe Usha Let didn't figure that out. Thank you. Yeah, I guess it's a card. Oh, I got Usha's potato chips. What a great card. Thanks, Usha. This will help me keep it zipped. That's right. to be like the super common one, nah, right? Don't. Just kidding, Usha. Your secret dies with me. Hopefully in many years' time. Like you get a pack of Deadly Premonition cards and all you get are the potato chips. And uh, what other weird ones have I gotten that are kind of lame? I know I've gotten more lame ones. But, like, I feel like potato chips are going to be in every pack, and everyone's going to just hate them. They're going to be worth, like, a penny. Alright, so I think we're done at the hospital, like, forever. I actually don't think we have to come back here ever again. So I'm- oh. Hello, janitor man. Are you the killer? They're not a suspect. Get over yourself. I'm going to open... I'm gonna relieve my- I cannot even, like, look at the toilet. Why did I come in here? What's the point? Alright, get me out of here. I'm done. Get me out of the hospital. Now I need to just wait till Anna's house is available and until Emily's available. 
I don't think there's anything else for me around these parts. Like your life, wahaha. -ha. The final time. I think I'm lost. Oh no. I've become lost and disoriented. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Oh my god, I'm in the uh, the weird save room. Can I just call the radio? That might be better. I could also just look at a map, but... Where's the fun in that? Nope. Alright, so if that was a weird save room, then I think over here is where I want to go. Which I think I was already over here. No, I did it. I escaped the hospital. I'm the hero. I solved it. I'm still a very stinky agent. I probably should have done something about this when I could have. But then again, I am going to be sleeping a lot again. So it wouldn't have helped much, would it? Before I go on a sleeping spree again, I might as well collect the bone here. Uh, this is, um... Actually, can I... Yeah, I can climb up. Oh, never mind. I'm good. This is, a. Uh one of the main things you are going to want to do is collect these bones. But we can't actually turn in the mission yet, so I'm not really going after them right away. But this uh, right foot bone was right here, so we might as well. Once we can use these bones, though, it gives us probably the best weapon in the game. A human bone? This doesn't look related to the case, but shouldn't I let some? How do you know it's not related? Fine, we have a bone now. I I gotta squat down. And now I can play the sleeping game. Emily! Let me in. Good. Got the rain, got the timing down. I might have been wrong about the other house I need to go for side missions. Okay, I guess we're just here now. Let me save. Let me save in Emily's house. What a lovely place. I appreciate that she lets me in instead of being cagey like George. What a rude boy George is. Uh, I thought I had to do something about like Anna's mom or something, but I might be forgetting about who exactly I need to talk to. But I guess we can go explore a little bit. I'm gonna explore. I'm taking your agent on her. I'm gonna look at your TV. She really seems to like watching TV. You never were interested in soap operas, were you, Zach? I guess that's why you don't watch TV. I like Superwoman. So she works out or burns calories on this bike each day. Which do you think is more likely, Zach? Uh, both? I don't know. Probably should talk to her before something weird happens and interrupts me. But I want to steal your bagel sandwich. Mmm, looks good. All right, Emily. Oh my God, look at this stove. So how's the chemistry experiment coming along? An experiment? I'm doing my best to learn how to cook better. Thank you very much. We Sorry learned about I that when I there. failed to do side quests before. I just couldn't resist it. Well, anyways, how about trying a taste for me then? Mm -mm. You mean a taste of this? Well, I think it came out pretty good. Mm, but probably I don't not. Hear other people's opinions, so I can improve my cooking. So come on, please. This is shocking, Zach. She's serious. I'm sure, it tastes delicious. So, what do you think? He just starts vomiting. Come on, tell me. Mm. Mm. It isn't entirely inedible. What's the best way of saying that, then, Zach? Uh, it tastes like trash, Emily? Ah, of course. It tastes like a... Nice try. <sighs> That's a, a decent way of explaining it, I guess. Emily, no need to get so depressed. This dish just needs one more ingredient. You need a certain fermented dairy product, and this will be perfect. A dairy product? What? If we get the chance, Zach and I will bring it to you. Then we can mix it in and I'll try it again, okay? What do you say? Thank you, Agent York. I won't get my hopes up too high, but I'll be here. Not always, though, Emily. I've come to your house a couple times and I think it really needs to be raining for it to work. 
All right, he hello. Uh, would you like some cheese in these trying times? Hey, that is why I bought the cheese before. Cheese? It's almost like I knew. I don't remember what the other ingredients are. I'm sure she needs an egg at some point. <laughs> I'm like telling her how her cooking sucks while I'm here with flies all over the place. Hmm. This does taste good. Like something Thomas mm, made. Don't flatter yourself too much, I agree girl. It's good, but this isn't in the same league with Thomas's cooking. His cooking is so precise, so delicate. I'm looking for an example here. Uh, not it's trash. Like listening to classical music during tea time on a holiday afternoon. This, however, is far more wild and running free. The two are opposite poles, really. Making yours, um, like. I don't think she likes anyway, the analogy. Both are edible, and that's the point I'm trying to make. Maybe she doesn't like the flies, too, though. Enough. But how did you know the cheese was the answer? I was looking at the ingredients, and it hit me. Milk, macaroni, flour, butter. You were trying to make macaroni and cheese, <laughs> right? Oh, she macaroni didn't do macaroni and cheese, and cheese right? Of course not. It's Italian beef stew. Where was the beef? Oh, that's why they say where's the beef? beef stew with no beef in it? I certainly haven't. At least not until today. Where's the beef? Here, have this Hawaiian blue suit. Agent York, sure. Why was it, it like a card? Perfect, but I'm glad I managed to make something edible. Here's a little something to say thank you for your help. Why didn't you have a suit? Nice try cooking. Alright, well now I'm gonna rummage through your stuff, Emily. Oh, that's the phone. I thought it was maybe something special. That's just a regular door. Oh, I'm getting lost and confused. I'm going upstairs. You can't stop me. I'm gonna open your drawer. Oh my god, what's in here? I got a card of Emily. I actually didn't realize I was in there, so I'm glad I rummaged. Agent Honor, can't go that way. Can I go into her room? No. Probably shouldn't try to get in there. I think you actually can't go into, like, most people's rooms. I'm also dying because I didn't eat yet, but I guess eating the meal actually did nothing for me. Let's see what Emily's bagel would do for me. I feel like it would kill me. A bagel sandwich made by Emily recovers both hunger and tiredness, but then makes them increase again faster. Mmm, doesn't sound great. Alright, well, we'll talk to you again later, Emily. How do I leave? Uh, so similar to the, uh, milk barn quest, we have to just do that every new mission, basically. But, because this mission, uh, I didn't explain it, but this mission is just talk to everyone at the town hall. We should be able to do the next step on everyone else's missions pretty quickly. I got bullets! Why were those in your mailbox, Emily? Emily! Why can't you cook good? Where was the beef, Emily? 